Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me Ubuntu Hokai and in this video I'm going to show you a lot of stuff about Compass Config Settings Manager. Now I've received a lot of comments and uh, requests on uh, if I could make a video showing you some uh, Compass effects and Compass animations. So I, I have already done that in the past, but uh, that's, I believe it's uh, two year old videos, so uh, I'm going to show you some cool animations and effects once again. So uh, let's just jump into uh, the crazy stuff. Uh, now first I, um, I recommend you guys to install Synaptic Package Manager uh, and if you don't already have that installed you can install it by Ubuntu Software Center. So uh, just go ahead and install that after then uh, open it. You'll just have to type in your password. Okay here we go. Uh, and uh, right now I'll type in compass there we go and if I scroll down you'll see right here it says compass plugins extra and that is basically what the name says uh, it gives you a lot of extra plugins animations and effects and options so uh, go ahead and install that and also right here we have Compass Fusion's uh, plugins extra, uh, which is even more animations and effects. So go ahead and install those two packages, and uh, after that, just close your Synaptic Package Manager, and we'll go ahead and open CCSM, which is Compass Config Settings Manager. Oh, freaking long words anyway, and long names. I mean, so. Uh, I'll show you some open and closing and minimizing and you know how to edit some effects and stuff like that in this video. So if we scroll down to uh, the effects tab or the effects sec section, we'll see animations right here. Uh, what you gotta do is you gotta open or click animations and you will see it says open animation, close animation, minimize animation, shade, focus and stuff like that. So um, now that we've uh, installed all the extra uh, animation plugins, uh, we have a lot of extra animations as you can see right here. Uh, I think you've only got like half of this if you don't install the extra plugins. Anyway, it says right here, uh, open animation and we have three options. Now the first one is for actually uh, the open animation of a normal window or a normal application or stuff like that. So the second one is for pop-up menus and drop-down menus and uh, the last one is for uh, notifications. Uh, so yeah. And again it's open animation. So if we click this first one here, as you can see it's set to glide 2 the open animation effect is called glide 2 and also you can change the uh, duration which basically means the time or the duration that the uh, effect lasts so um, you can play around with that and uh, you can have a look at what your preferred settings are but uh, if I just click this you can change to a lot of uh, different animations if I go to the top and select random it will basically give me a random effect every time I open a window. So uh, I hit close right here and I'll just minimize CCSM and open my home folder and you can see BAM! BAM! WHOOSH! ka -ching. So Basically a, a random animation every time you open and also you can play around this to your um, to get your preferred animations. Uh, and again I have set these to uh, none because I think it looks more professional and not just over effect-ish if that's a word. <laughs> so uh, I'll go back and select Glide 2 because I think that looks pretty professional. So. Um, that is the open animation. Now right here we have close animation which is basically the same thing for um, windows and 
pop-up menus, drop-down menus, and right here it's a notification at the bottom. So um, a lot of you guys have been asking me uh, how I do the burn effect. Well, this is how I do. But I will show you guys uh, later on in this video how you can actually, you know, change the options uh, or I mean tweak the options a little bit to um, to get the perfect animation, I guess you could say. So uh, right here I have set it at burn and the duration is set to 120. So uh, for the sake of this video I'll just say 120. 50 maybe yeah that's fine so I'll show you that later in this uh, video we also have mm, uh, minimize animation which is set to glide 2 I'll just try to change that to um, random and uh, the duration is set to 220 so uh, if I just minimize TCSM BAM WHOOSH PING how you like the sound effects too it doesn't do that in compass it's just me making the sound <laughs> anyway I'll change that back to I think it was glide 2 because I think glide 2 looks awesome you can just see it right here just a fast nice effect anyway we also have shade animation and focus animation and what else we have some effect settings so if you want to change your effect settings, you can do that. But um, I'm going to show you this later. Uh, basically, you can just play around with uh, this to get whatever you want it to look like. So if you go to focus animation, uh, when you install Ubuntu, then by default, it's going to say none right here. But I like the Dutch effect. Um, so I'm going to show you what the Dutch effect is. And it's set to uh, 150 duration, that's fine. If I open my home folder, and if I just put it right there, and if I open my terminal, and if I place it here, I guess. Now let's say I want to use Compass Config Settings Manager. So I click, and it gives me this cool effect. I want to use my terminal, I want to use my home folder, as you can see it looks very very awesome so that's that let me just close all this again and as you can see the burn effect when I when I uh, close the windows BAM so anyway when you're finished playing around with this you'll have to go back and right here also in the effects category we have animations add-on now let me just minimize all this because it looks pretty horrible right here you see it says burn now this is what I use to uh, get my burn effect uh, customized so uh, we have number of fire particles fire particle size fire particle slowdown life and color uh, fire direction and stuff like that so you can customize this to the way you want so uh, if just to show you I will select actually I think I will choose a pink color and right there oh it's so manly okay a pink color fire direction I will change that to up um, fire particle size let's just change that to <laughs> this that's fine number of fire particles what the heck there we go uh, and fire smoke will have that on too so if I just minimize CCSM again and open my home folder and take a look when I close the home folder. Wow! Nice. Sweet. <laughs> Actually it looks pretty girly. But I like that. Okay so you can change that to uh, the way you want. Uh, normally I have this set to about 250. Uh, I believe this was five so let me just do that again and I will not use smoke and I'll set that to down and let me see fire particle life let me just change that to one that's fine and then I'll close my 
home folder right here for you guys. There you can see. So the particle life is actually very long. That was uh, a quick video showing you guys how to get. Uh, actually, I'll just change this back to uh, blue because that's the way I like it. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Okay. And then close CCSM. Actually, this was the video. If you'd like more videos with uh, where I'm showing you the different compass animations, then please post a comment saying, I want more! Or something like that. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Girl Scout.